Breaking news, crews racing to the scenes of several fires. The dry conditions and windy weather proving to be a dangerous combination, plus a building going up in flames. And you can see the, the gusty winds are hampering efforts underway right now. Good evening, everyone, and thank you for joining us. At one point, our assignment desk here at the station counted as many as three fires burning basically at the same time. Let's go right to Channel 8's Mackenzie Johnson. She is live in North Lincoln at the one scene. Mackenzie, what can you tell us? Yeah, Rod and Megan, like you guys mentioned, that wind is playing a major factor in the fires today, just like this one right behind me at a used car dealership near 22nd and Cornhusker Highway. Crews have started to clear out now, but this was a major working scene earlier this afternoon. They were fighting this fire defensively all afternoon since they were called about 2.30 on reports of popping noises and smoke in the area. Officials say it started as a car fire inside the shop. Wind was moving through it, carrying the flames and making it much worse. LFR had to put crews up on ladders to help fight the fire from above since it was so dangerous they couldn't send anyone inside the building. Around 3.30 this afternoon, the roof on the back half of the building collapsed, which put pressure on the walls, and soon after that, the west wall also collapsed. Luckily, crews were able to keep the fire from spreading to any other buildings, and no one was injured in the fire. No estimate yet on the amount of damage or what sparked that car fire for now, LFR is asking drivers to avoid westbound Cornhusker Highway as they continue clearing the scene and doing their investigation. We'll be keeping you updated as we get any new information, and I'll be joining you guys live again at 6 with sound from Chief Mark Majors talking about the, their uh, fighting of this fire this afternoon. Reporting in Lincoln, Mackenzie Johnson, Channel 8 News.